Swift and Brittany Mahomes looked like they were well on their way to becoming BFFs. But then out of nowhere, everything changed and it looks like neither Brittany nor Taylor are going to address it, which might be because of why things fell apart between them. But what actually happened? Let's get into it. As of right now, it looks like the friendship that had formed between Taylor and Brittany has gone down the drain and it fizzled out so fast that a lot of people are wondering if they were even actually friends in the first place or were they just doing it for the camera and attention it would bring because let's be real Brittany and Taylor got a lot of screen time during the games all that had to happen was for the Kansas City Chiefs to get a touchdown or maybe a few good plays here and there and immediately the cameras would hand to Taylor and Brittany celebrating passionately if you weren't following the games well let's just say that the Chiefs had a lot of touchdowns and some really good plays in fact Brittany and Taylor celebrated enough times that they decided to make their own celebratory handshake and of course the cameras caught on to what Taylor and Brittany were doing still not everyone was a fan of how much TV time Taylor and Brittany were getting in fact some football fans went out of their way to complain about the amount of screen time they got but that didn't really change anything which is why what's going on now is so crazy now that the season is over it looks like their friendship has gone with it however from the looks of things there might be a more sinister reason why Brittany and Taylor are no longer friends apparently the two of them were getting along pretty well some might even go as far as to say that they had as much chemistry as their partners did on the field but then there were rumors that Brittany was doing something that didn't sit well with Taylor and you're not going to believe what according to Dumois it looks like Brittany was going out to the paparazzi and the tabloids to give out some juicy tips about Taylor not only were Taylor and Brittany spending a lot of time together during the games but apparently they also had a thing going on outside the games and that was how Brittany got all the juicy information that she then allegedly shared with the media Taylor would invite Brittany out and they would have luncheons and dinners the two were first seen hanging out together back in September 2023 at the time they were having dinner while they were waiting for the Chiefs game to start later in the evening sometimes Brittany also got to meet some of Taylor's famous friends according to the Daily Express US Taylor and Brittany were seen with Blake Lively Ryan Reynolds and Sabrina Carpenter and not just them Brittany also got to meet many more of Taylor's friends and as I'm sure you can imagine most of her friends are a-list celebrities then there was also the viewing party that Taylor hosted the Chiefs were going to play the Miami Dolphins and it wasn't going to be in Miami or Kansas City instead the game was held in Germany so Taylor decided to throw a viewing party and invited some of her friends including Brittany and also the significant others of the other G players now of course it ended up being a nice time but then when word got out that Brittany was supposedly giving out information about Taylor to the media Taylor allegedly didn't like that one bit which honestly makes sense Taylor is a huge superstar and it must be really hard for her to maintain at least some kind of privacy so to have someone from her private life giving out information freely about what she's doing well I can see why she wouldn't like that at all obviously none of this has actually been confirmed but from the looks of things it seems like Taylor found out that Brittany was the one leaking all the information especially the stuff about her whereabouts and where she was going to be at a particular Chiefs game or not and since then Taylor has supposedly been pumping the brakes on her friendship with Brittany but there's more another reason why people believe that Taylor might be distancing herself from Brittany is because Brittany might be trying too hard if we're being honest not a lot of people are in the same celebrity category as Taylor and Brittany herself might be way down on the celebrity ladder but now she has a direct connection with Taylor thanks to Travis Kelsey and the Chiefs and some people are saying that she is trying really hard to get on the same level as Taylor even going as far as copying her style and it's supposedly getting to the point where Taylor wants to put some distance between them according to Newsweek Brittany's game day outfits were looking more Taylor-esque with each passing game day now not a lot of people took too kindly to this change and when Brittany posted a picture of herself on one particular game day well let's just say a lot of the comments were not so positive about Britney's new fashion choices then again some people didn't think that this was really an issue because if we're being honest a lot of fashion is inspired by others and if Britney was getting inspired by Taylor then that's not really a bad thing at all there were also more rumors around Taylor's birthday in December she threw a lavish birthday party in New York at the box and of course she invited many of her friends now some people were absent like Travis for example but then Travis had a practice that he couldn't miss so everyone understood why he couldn't be there but what's strange is that it doesn't look like anybody really
related to the Chiefs made it to the party, including Brittany. You'd expect Brittany to be there considering that's who Taylor has been the closest with aside from Travis. But Brittany was nowhere to be seen, so this just fueled the rumors that Taylor and Brittany were on the rocks. And then to make things look even worse, it doesn't seem like Brittany gave a shout out to Taylor on her birthday, so it just doesn't look like they're on the best of terms right now. Then again, they have since been seen hanging out together again, and on February 2nd, Brittany defended Taylor in her Instagram stories. She made it clear that she didn't think that Taylor ruined football, so maybe they're back to being friends now. But what do you guys think? Do you think Taylor and Brittany are actually close, or are they just being cordial with each other because of their significant others having to play together? Let me know what you think in the comments below.